Hello everyone. Hello. Got Joy and Logan up front. We're on our way to Logan's therapy. I had my doctor's appointment earlier. I thought I was supposed to have a physical today, but they didn't say anything, so I didn't say anything. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'll, I got plenty of time in the rest of the year to have a physical. But anyway, at least my uh, my triglycerides were lower this time, and my blood pressure was good, so that's a good thing. But I gained, <laughs> I gained like five more pounds, I think. Ouch. So I need to work on that, that's the main thing. He must have gone the wrong way. Decided he had to go the other way. I'm sure there's been people trying to turn here and go that way, I bet even. But uh, today is my mom's birthday. Happy birthday, mom. And uh, while Logan's in his therapy, you know, we usually do something. So we're going to run back here. It's not that far away to mom's apartment. So Joy and I are going to go over there. We've got her a present. It's not convenient, I'm sure, for her to have Mother's Day cl so close to her birthday. It's like if your birthday was at Christmas, yeah. you know, which are you, you get Christmas presents, you get birthday presents. Oh, which one's which? You know, so. Pals, oh, it looks good right now. So it went fairly well, I guess. Started me back on this medicine. I believe it, I could be wrong. I'll have to see what the name of it is again. But I believe it's generic for Fosamax for uh, osteoporosis. And if it's the same thing I tried the first time, it made me sick. Every time I took it, I would feel nauseated and sick for about, what, an hour, Joy? Uh, he said I wasn't upright enough or something. Like I have to be. I don't necessarily standing up, but at least sitting up. Because lots of times I'll just lay on the couch, especially in the morning. So he said try standing up and walking around or do something. Or at least sit straight up. But I'll try them again, but you know, if they make me super sick, I'll have to find... You know, he said there's a shot you can get, but it's really expensive. Well, I don't really need nothing you know, expensive. I already am in enough debt over my... And tibio infusions. So, just do what I can. It's not that great of a day, but it has stopped raining, hasn't it, for now, Joy? It was sprinkling a little bit ago. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, it's overcast. What's the temperature it say? Right. 62. 62. I think the high was supposed to be 63 today. It's kind of cool. Mom doesn't live far from Evergreen Garden Center that we went to. Well, you pulled out off the slow in front of that guy. I knew it. Look at him. I don't think he liked that, Joy. I don't care if he's flying. No, he, he was. Well, he was flying. You gotta, you gotta expect people to be flying on this road.
they do. They'll go 70 mile an hour down through here. I think what I think the speed limit's like 50, but they fly like it's the highway. It's because there's four lanes. All right, I'm gonna pause it for a minute. All right, on our way to Mom's now. It's completely overcast today. I think there's a chance of rain. What? Next, how many days? It's supposed to rain out every day this week. Every day. Except for Saturday. Well, I sure won't have to uh, water the garden. Nope. I got some cucumbers out that I bought at the ones I bought at Walmart, the Japanese ones. I got them planted before we left and got the trellises out there for the cucumbers. So, in the middle, I still need to plant carrots, radishes, and cucumber seeds. And then it'll be done. And then the third one that I'm calling the Garden of Charity, as far as I know, the only thing I want to have in it right now is eggplants and zucchini. That's all, zucchini on one side, eggplants on the other, that's why they're away from each other. Except for in the middle, I guess they'll get close to each other but at least they won't be covering everything else up uh, especially the zucchini it's bad for covering everything nothing can get any sunlight and they grow so fast you could you can go out there and cut a bunch of those big old leaves off of them and stems and go out there the next day and you can't even hardly tell you have that's how fast they grow or at least in the next couple days they'll be back like they were I constantly was having to cut, cut them, and I'd like to leave them on there, but you had to, they were, everything was so close, they were covering everything, you know. They wouldn't grow right. This used to be a two-lane long time ago, remember, Joy? Even to Bristol. Yeah. It took them a long time to get it fixed. I mean, when they were doing this, they, it was a mess. Remember? Oh yeah. It was a real mess because there's a lot of traffic on this road. I'd like to go to that pizza place sometime, Mellow Mushroom. Oh, we do. That's what it's called. That used to be El Chico's. Did El Chico's go completely out of business? I think so. Do y'all ever, did y'all ever have an El Chico's or do you have an El Chico's Mexican restaurant? It was a great place to eat, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Oh, their fajitas were crazy good. They'd bring them plates to you and it would be like a, what was it, like a metal plate on a wooden thing and it would be, Sizzling, oh man. Yeah. We went there, you know, whenever we wanted Mexican or especially fajitas. And we shared, I mean, we could share one, remember? We mm -hmm. bought just one, one order. I think when the kids were young, they had some kind of deal for the kids. And O'Charlie's, which it's still here and we never go to anymore, uh, had 12 and under eat free, you know, kids, and we always did that. These mountains right up here against the road. There's a road going up through there too. Probably for that tower, yeah. It's for that tower. They have to be able to get to it. Well, they had to build it. For one thing, so they had to build a road through to it. But look at that stuff. It's like rock. I don't know. 
some kind of rock. Looks like shale almost back in there. Looks like they've been getting some of that from back in there, hauling it off. Or if they're gonna put a house up in there one day. They got, uh, well, they're they're not apartments. They got like condos up in, up on one of these mountains. What are they called? I can't remember what they're called now. And they are. They used to make deliveries for a florist, and it was horrible trying to find the, those places. Especially when it was snowy, because it was straight up that mountain. The wrong road. You think we were going to Evergreen? No, I was thinking that was a road to her. No, it's a, it's on down. Down by the funeral home. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. There's a light here too now. Let me pull it out. some kind of art center that we just yeah, passed. Yeah, I went over. there for something. Yeah, uh, but it looks like it's not, it's closed down or whatever. The sign's not on the wall anymore. I don't think we've taken y'all this way. We took y'all to Evergreen with us uh, whatever it was, about a week ago or less. But uh, I don't think we've taken y'all this far before, so this is a new, new area for drive with us. It's pretty up through here. But they got a bunch of houses socked back in there. I'll tell you that. Here's the funeral home. That's where Joy's mother and father both had their funerals. Mom. Mom went and paid for hers in advance. That's, you know, be a hard thing to do. But she's got everything in order for, you know. She's 86 now. Is, she, is it 86 today, right? Is I mean, this it? Um, I don't know if it's this one. You can go in either one, though. Okay, we're here, so we're going to... Pause this for now. All right, everyone. Had a good visit with mom. We bought her a nice necklace. We gave her cards the other day. Yeah. And uh, she really liked it. I had to help put it on her. Seem to really like it too. Yeah. I mean, Mom is she doesn't waste any words. You know, she'll she'll tell you if she doesn't like something. Oh yeah, she? she'll tell you. <laughs> oh, that's 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 okay. Uh, yeah, I like it, I guess. <laughs> well, we knew she would like this. Kind of like it was hard for me to hide if I got socks for Christmas and underwear. It's kind of hard to act like you liked them when you were little. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't get clothes for Christmas. Well, I did. I got toys. We would get like one or two, you know, regular presents, but then we got clothes every year. Now, if I got clothes like that, I'd be like, all right, underwear. <laughs>
Princeton Art Center. That's what that place was called. The little tacos grill right there we've been wondering about. Local place. Um, I think one of my it was uh, one of my friends said it was good. He said he went there. Nice area to walk in. We got a sidewalk down through here. Be perfect for walking. Beautiful trees in there too. Well, we're on our way back. I think I'm going to end it for now, y'all. If you enjoyed it please press that like button subscribe if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so that you get all my videos as soon as they come out bye 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 everyone have a great evening i'll be doing uh i'll probably be doing ask my tablet later on i'll see how it feels so everybody have a great evening i'll see you later god bless